quite often in consulting, you will like to create a chart like this one. So a stacked one with a total at the very end. Unfortunately, Excel does not allow to achieve this result automatically. So we will have to use a small trick to create a chart like that. So let's see how we can do that in practice. Please go to the sheet stacked with total. And here we already have the data that we will need for the chart. So we've got the sales by years and by business units, we've got dentists, GP doctors, others. And at the very bottom in draw 10, we've got the total. So the first thing we have to do is simply to insert stacked chart, including the total. So we select the whole area. We press insert. We go to the home chart and we pick the second option. So we've got the chart. Now we will add the data labels. For the second, the third data series, and for the last one. Now we will use a small trick. So we will select the last data series responsible for the total. We'll right click on that with the mouse. And then in the case of colors, just fill no fill. And as you can see, we almost get the effect we wanted to have. However, we want data labels to be a little bit lower. So we will have to click on the data labels, press format data labels. And here in the label options, we've got label position and we've got the following option. So currently it's in the center. However, it can be inside and and inside base. Inside base will move this data labels higher. Inside base will keep it a little bit closer to the chart. And this is what we will select. Now, the only thing we have to do is work on formatting. So we have to press Control B to make it bolder. Going to do it also for the second data labels series and third and fourth. We'll also change color for the first three. So we're going to change it to white. We'll remove the grid. So we'll press the grid and then delete. We're going to remove the title and also the axis. So we select the axis, we press delete. So we almost got the chart we wanted to have. We are left with a few small modification. So let's get rid of the outline. So let's press on the plot area and then pick no outline. And maybe let's make the axis bolder as well as the legend. And there you've got, we managed to create a chart with the total at the top of the chart. Obviously they will automatically adjust. So if we change here to let's say 800, as you can see, the last column, including the total, will adjust as well. So have a look at that. And as always, I recommend repeating what we have done here on your own.